Anticipation builds as the MiG-41, a groundbreaking aircraft possessing truly space capabilities, is set to make its maiden flight this year. That this superior machine is on the brink of being commissioned and is expected to join the ranks of the Russian Air Force within the next two to three years. As per the insights from Russian journalists, the MiG-41 stands unparalleled in its class. The time is ripe for the MiG-41 to step into the limelight and replace the venerable yet still potent MiG-31. Russian reports suggest that the MiG-41 will operate in near-space conditions, achieving speeds exceeding Mach 3. The aircraft is said to be capable of launching satellites into low orbits, intercepting hypersonic missiles, and performing various other feats. These bold assertions have led the US to dub the MiG-41 a fantasy. While it's premature to definitively categorize the MiG-41 as either a figment of imagination, there seems to be significant progress within the Russian PAC-DP project. The MiG-41 is classified as belonging to the 5++ and potentially even the 6th generation of aircraft. Its avionics are not solely designed for manned flights. Given the lack of necessity for a human to endure overloads, provision has been made for unmanned operation. The apparent paradox of achieving near hypersonic speeds while maintaining effective stealth technology remains an intriguing enigma. It is well documented that upon reaching speeds of 3,000 km per hour, conventional stealth coatings tend to deteriorate rapidly, making the aircraft highly visible on radar. The subsequent repairs to restore stealth capabilities are predictably costly. This leaves one wondering how the design team was able to address this seemingly intractable